A follow up now to breaking news we first talked about on Fox News at 5.30. It involves a shooting that happened in Pritchard just a few hours ago. Police say a 17 year old girl was walking a baby in a stroller when someone shot her in the back. Fox 10 News reporter Katie Weiss joins us now live from USA Medical Center where the victim is being treated. Katie, what's going on here? Thanks, Bob Lanise. Now, actually, the victim is here being treated right now at USA Medical Center, and there's still no word on her condition. But one suspect is in custody tonight for this crime. Now, I was on scene earlier today, and police were out there looking for shell casings, traces of gunpowder, anything that could help move the investigation forward. Take a look. A 17 year old girl was pushing a baby in a stroller through a field on the corner of Garrison Avenue and Easterling Street when she was shot in the back. Pritchard Police and Mobile County Sheriff's deputies responded to the scene around 4 o'clock. They tell me the girl was taken to a nearby hospital and have not released her condition. The baby is okay and was released to a family member. Here's what Pritchard Police Chief Jerry Spezial had to tell me about the investigation. And can you tell us the name of the person who was arrested? I cannot at this point. Okay. Okay, we are still continuing. Of course. And so do you believe that there are other suspects involved? I really can't comment on that at this point. At this point, it's an active investigation. Spezial did say he believes the shooting to stem from a domestic dispute and canine units were on scene to sniff for gunpowder traces. Meanwhile, nearby neighbors who wanted to remain anonymous tell me they are scared something like this could happen so close to home. I mean, it's crazy. I mean, that shouldn't be going on. You got kids in the neighborhood and folk around here shooting like they ain't got no sense. I mean, it, it's wrong. And while this is Chief Spezial's first big case as chief, neighbors are anxious to see how he performs. Since they got a new chief, I don't know, you know, it might make a change, but like I say, it remains to be seen. Yeah. I wish he would. <laughs> And now I tried to contact Pritchard Police today to ask about how the investigation is going to see if there are any new updates, but I still haven't heard back from them. We'll be sure to bring you more information on this crime as those details become available. For now, I'm reporting live from USA Medical Center, Katie Weiss, Fox 10 News. Meanwhile, we're learning more tonight about a murder victim, Terry Crawford. He's a homeless man.